So I'm sitting out here, 6 o'clock in the morning, working on my motorcycle. Last couple of weeks, I kept saying, man, I got an exhaust leak somewhere. So I said, let me tighten up my exhaust manifold bolts. I'm like, nah, that leak's still there, and it's bothering me. So I decided to take the bike apart, and look what I find. There's no exhaust manifold gaskets in there. And I can't be mad at nobody but myself. Because I'm the one that put the motor in. When you're trying to ride quickly, you forget shit. So I already ordered some new ones. Got them right here. I'm about to install them. And I'll get back to you when they end. So five minutes later, we're struggling trying to get the exhaust manifold as close as I could and slip one of them in there they kept falling out so not only that these kept getting hung up under the radiator and under the oil cooler so I tied them up to keep them up they sound good in my head so I'm gonna see if I can actually get them in try to get one as close as I could pop it in and get uh, the gasket in there put a bolt in there and try to go all the way down. You know, I need a second hand. Won't one of you guys give me a hand? So yeah, I was able to do that. Get the exhaust as close as I could. Slip one in there and then push it in there. I got one more left to do. Way over on the other side. I'm about to go over there now. And see if I can get this in and I'm gonna definitely make sure I can get a few turns on them before I start tightening these things down I'm not trying to strip anything so I got everything tightened up best as I'm gonna get it I'm known for stripping things so I'm just gonna button it back up and put this fan back on the radiator <clears throat> so I'm down here on the other side putting in this last bolt now we're going to go on the other side and tighten up the other two got this one down here at the bottom Got this one up here at the top. I don't know if I can see that one. Where are we? Right up in there. Make sure. Plug up your fan. Now we can go ahead and get this radiator mounted back up. So I'm going to try and mount this top radiator bolt up there. So I got this side up. It's not tight, but it's got a couple turns on it. Now I'm going to go to the other side. Got this side in. Get a couple turns on it. I couldn't show y'all because um my tripod don't extend that high, and I couldn't hold the camera and do it. So now we're gonna get these two bottom clamps in. We'll go around to the other side. Get the last one. Now I'm gonna get these up on try pop 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 but it's alright. Get these two bolts for the uh, oil cooler to the radiator bracket. Oh man, the Lord is on my side today. We'll just leave that loose and 
take you around to the other side, get that one in. I know I gotta get another oil cooler, that's for sure. Just tighten the other one up. All right, she tight. Just double check everything. Radiator support brackets, oil cooler brackets. Only thing I got to do is put my fairings back on. This side don't never stay in right there. I'm telling you, this fair does not go on this easy. I don't know what the heck is going on. Ain't this about a BI? This one boat go up here at the top. Other side, get that other side fairing. Grab this fairing and these screws. There we go. There we go. There we go. This joint is lining up. about repainting it. Same color. It's going to be cleaner. Instead of the white rims, I'm going to go with gold. I don't know. I'm just thinking. Thinking out loud. I get this. Go ahead and put the tools away.
let's go ahead and see what it sound like.